Ju Jin Ma used to be quite a popular actor back in the days. His famous works, like a 200-pound beauty, made him a lot of fans. However, one incident changed his life forever. Here is the story of Ju Jin Ma. Ju was born on August 11, 1974 in Seoul, South Korea. He borrowed his manager's name Ju Jin Mo for his stage name when he began his acting career. He made his theater debut with Taxi Driver in 1997. He made his first big screen appearance in the movie Park v. Park but couldn't gather any attention. Thereafter, he appeared in KBS 2's drama Sad Temptation in 1999. He then appeared in the movie Dance Dance in 1999. He went through professional dance training for his role in the movie. After gaining publicity from his minor roles, he finally captured the hearts of his audience through the smash hit flick Happy End, a movie that got him his due success. His portrayal of a distant lover in the romantic drama got him a lot of attention from Korean and overseas audiences. In 2000, he appeared in KBS 2's show, Look Back in Anger and acted in another movie titled, Real Fiction which was shot in just 3.5 hours without any retakes. In 2001, he took on another major role in one of the biggest motion pictures in the history of Korean cinema, Musa, a movie that was set in 14th century China. He starred opposite Zhang Zi of Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon fame. He starred in the melodrama Wani and Juna in which he played an easygoing writer who struggles to make it big. He then became part of SBS boxing drama, Punch. In 2005, he starred in SBS hit show, Fashion 70s with Lee yo -won. In 2006, he starred in Puzzle, a movie about a bank robbery gone wrong. He starred in another romantic comedy, 200 Pounds Beauty, which became quite popular at the time of its release. He also became part of the TV series, Queen of the Game. In 2007, he starred in the gangster romance, A Love Along with Park si -yun. The following year, he starred in the controversial movie, A Frozen Flower, which was about a love triangle between a homosexual Goryeo king, his queen, and the royal guard. In 2009, he returned to television with SBS series Dream in which he played a sports agent to a K-1 fighter. In 2010, he appeared in A Better Tomorrow along with Sun Sung Yun. The film came to be known as John Woo's classic Hong Kong noir. In 2011, he sang Like Rain, Like Music by late singer Kim Hyun Sik during his first fan meeting in Japan. His singing skills were so admired by the fans that he ended up releasing his own cover of the same song and released the digital single in September 2011. In 2012, he returned to silver screen with his portrayal of a 19th century con man in Gabby. The con man gets indulged in a political conspiracy involving King Gojong. He starred in another historical drama, Empress Key, in which he played a character based on King Chung Hai. He also starred in the sequel to the 2001 hit movie, Friend, The Great Legacy, in which he played a gangster. In 2017, he starred in Bad Guys 2 and in 2019 he did Big Issue. However, since then he has not acted anywhere. It is not known why, but it could be because of his scandal. Ju Jin Mo was embroiled in a smartphone hacking incident in 2020 and was embroiled in a privacy controversy in which a messenger conversation he had with an acquaintance was leaked. Many fans were worried. But their sympathy quickly turned to anger when the hackers revealed Ju's text messages with another handsome star and his best friend, Jang Donggun. The messages show two men sharing pictures of young women and making lewd comments about them. In a statement Thursday, Ju fiercely denied taking their photos illegally, but was silent on whether he made the remarks. At that time, Ju Jinemo's agency said that criminal hackers threatened him, adding, he bows his head to the women who were mentioned in his text messages and asks for forgiveness. He didn't commit the immoral act of secretly taking photos of women's bodies and spreading them. Afterwards, Ju Jinemo filed a criminal complaint against the subject of hacking and blackmail through his legal representative, and the hackers were sentenced to prison. 
Ju Jin Mo's wife Min Hai Yun deleted her social media profile at that time, following her husband's phone hacking scandal. I did not know about this before making this video, so it is very surprising. Sad to see this, as 200 Pound Beauty is my favorite movie. Hopefully, he has learned from his mistakes and won't do the same, especially when he is married now. The text messages said it was from 2013. He was last seen on his wife's Instagram. She shared photos of them celebrating Ju's birthday. Thank you for watching and see ya.